Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forge. So as promised, we got our lance repaired between episodes, and we moved to a new system for Leo. It was only 12 days away, so it was a it was an easy jump for us. Um, and in the command center here, if we go to contracts, we've got a bunch of contracts here that we can actually do, I think. There's some stuff a little later on here. Uh, abandoned uh, manufacturing facility, illegal intrusion into our territory to destroy base mission we can do. Um, there's a corporate secrets recovery um, against pirates, dead or alive, no, sorry, it's a reconquest, um, heavily armed pirate band, three skull, escaping spy, I think we can, no, that's Icelian. So there's a few here that we can actually do. So we're going to take these, but first thing we're going to try and do is this uh, settling a grudge. It's one skull versus clan wolf. Now, the half skull missions have been really horribly bad against us. Uh, but we've had to face more than one lance. My guess is that this is going to be one heavily armed lance, roughly. Uh, if it ends up being stiffer resistance than we think, we're going to pull out. Destroy as much as we can, obviously, and pull out. But um, we're going to take this mission today to see what we can do. Because we want to test this lance out against um, uh, the clans just to see how we're doing here. So we're going to negotiate this and go full salvage and accept. Also, between episodes, I sold some of our pirate stuff, the two pirate flamers and the pirate gauss rifle. Just we had some extra currency on hand just in case we needed to repair our mechs after taking on the clan. So, uh, yeah, so we got a bit of cash flow. So we're going to go with our standard lance and deploy and get this done. All right, here we go. Oh, just to keep an eye out for enemy reinforcements. So reinforcements will most likely be coming from here. They could be coming from... Uh, no, I don't think so, but probably from over here. They sometimes come from behind you. All right, uh, recoil. Let's see what we can see up here. Okay, not too bad. Fire started 2C, fire started... Uh, okay. Both Gauss Rifles. What would possess them to put Gauss Rifles in Fire Starters? I mean, sure, why not? Heads up, Commander. You've got yeah. Okay, they can already see us, so... We need to get in here fast and smash these guys as fast as we can. I copy. Let's fire on this guy. Fire everything. Okay, a little bit of damage. How much armor does this guy have? 600 and something, right? 625. These guys are the same, okay. Uh... I think because they've got that uh, gauss rifle, we got to stay in the trees here. Ugh. Damn it, I missed. Can't quite get in the trees here, but we can get darn close enough. Yeah, it's a pretty low chance to hit, but we're going to fire everything. Eighty tonner figures. Okay, we're gonna kill what we can. Ah, uh, we did a little over a hundred damage to that guy. Thirty-five tons. Yeah, it's pretty darn accurate. So we're going to keep fleeing these guys. 
I think we're going to try and head up on top of the hill here. Huh. Might be able to get it back shot in this guy if we get up this road a bit. Another one. Great. Jesus Christ. I think we're going to take the opportunity here to try and get back shots on this guy. It's his back armor like pretty darn low. If we get lucky. Okay, got a bit of damage on him. CT, nice. All we gotta do is take one of those torsos, I think, and he's done. Let's see if the Centurion can get behind him. Just not quite, eh? You can. Much as I'd like to do a called shot in this guy, our chance to hit would be almost nothing, so we're gonna fire everything. Like I think that was a leg hit. Solid leg hit, too. It's gonna be a side shot, though, if we do it this way. Let's go for direct fire. Fire everything on this guy. I was hoping for more leg hits than that. At least he's unstable now and I can go with the uh, Ultra 10 here. What? How are we hitting the other leg? Oh, for, oh right, because, uh, never mind. What the hell is that thing? Phoenix Hawk 2C at 80 tons? Huh? Yeah, here comes the lasers now. Where are you going? Yeah, you know what? In this particular version of Rogue Tech, the clans feel like a total threat now. You understand how they over basically just overrun the inner sphere with these guys. It's an 80 ton. Two Ultra 10s. That guy's still running. No, this was the guy that we hit. Okay, Pylon. What's up, boss? Right side on this guy, please.
Yeah. Okay, arm, torso. Ugh. Okay, we can still kill the guy though. Okay, everything on this side of this guy. Hopefully we kill him. Okay, good. One less time. Okay, so I guess the clan XL engines. Um, we don't have enough for vigilance yet. Terrified of not having enough uh, stability here. Well, he's on our only target, so let's go after him. A lot of armor. Yeah. Roger. Full sprint. And fire on this guy. Really bad chances to hit. Okay, I'm on it. Well, at least we hit with one. Okay. He's got really low stability, that guy, though. <gasps> He's coming for a melee attack. Ooh. What's his back armor like? Really freaking good. Yeah, they know which guy to shoot, that's for sure. Is that a white? Sure is. Look at the evasion on that guy. Ah. Okay, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go full sprint and come around and kill this guy next. Making sure our sides are turned here. Don't want to give him a clear shot to the CT. Okay, got lucky there.
that heavy mech's going to follow us up here. That might be a good thing, though. We might be able to kill him up here. I definitely need heavier mechs, though. There's no way we can be... Like, you got to come in with at least heavy and assaults against this. Until we get some clan chassis. But we're slowly working up to that. We're slowly getting some clan gear, which is good. So maybe we get a little bit out of this mission. Okay, looks like the homing beacon hit. Nice. Enemy flanking. Sorry, man, we're out of here. Waiting for order. Hey, let's see what this baby can do. Yeah. Trying to get as much out of direct line of sight as I possibly can here. Let's force them to come to us. I think though we're going to take out this fire starter and then we're going to leave before we incur any real damage here. Watch them jump off here though. That's another fire starter coming up here. Where's he going? He's trying to run. Okay, we can finally get my stability back here. Everything into the side of this guy. Okay, he's unstable. Don't care how we kill these guys now, as long as they go down. That guy's got MMLs. Or ATMs, sorry. Good to go. Pylon first. Nope, sorry, recoil yeah. first. Gonna move up. And fire everything. All right. I'll give them the whole Ready for orders. Okay, get our stability back. Fire everything. Okay, right torso. You're not going to be able to get your stability back, but you got to get up here anyway, so full speed ahead. Let's try and finish this guy up. Okay, going down, two pilot injuries. Okay, let's see what they do. Ah, oh, he's almost cored. So we're going to core him. If they go, if they move this way, and this guy, oh, he's moving this way too. Okay. All right. Um, On my way. Will that be enough? Probably. I copy. Tango 
Okay. Okay, let's see what we can do here. I want to see if we can get somebody in the back here. If we, if we crest this hill and shoot somebody straight in the back. I mean, can't get that 80 tonner anywhere. Huh. Fifty five tonner, twenty five tonner. Who do we target though? I got a feeling that this guy is the uh, locust, which means he's got tons of armor. But he sides to us, so we might be able to burrow through it. start with you since you have the highest evasion and a tag let's try the locust 19% eh? 14 55 on the medium Kentaro 2c ATMs and a heavy large heavy laser with lots of armor okay white's got almost the same armor as the fire starters do this guy's got more Just fire on the Kentaro. Let's see what he does. We got the tag on him. Depends on where he moves, right? Okay. That's our target. on this guy. Let's hope we get lucky get some head hits in here. Okay, he's almost unstable. Uh, Hickory yeah. has the best chance I think of making him unstable. Let's get up here. Acknowledge. Yep, firing. Copy that. Nice. Let's try this. All weapons are oh, looks like we got two hits where we wanted to. And he knocked him down. Nice. Which means we all go before him next turn. Okay. Here comes the 80 tonner. Probably got one more turn before we have to deal with him. 
Yeah, here they come. Shit. Not much I can do about this now. Yeah, we gotta go. Yeah, we gotta bail. Come on, send me a real mech warrior. Oh, don't say things like that, man. This guy's got the ER large. Oh, thank goodness he missed. Okay. So one person is not going to get to shoot. So I'm thinking recoil, you're out. Well, let's start here. I might be able to clear his head. Let's give it a shot. Okay, one head hit. Oh. Down to 24. I'm gonna kill him the big bubble. Okay, cool. We got that guy. Hostile removed. Are you trapped there? You're trapped. Shoot. Yep. Let's see if we get lucky. If we don't blow this guy's back armor up, we're gonna leave. Well, we're not gonna kill him. Oh, it's so tempting. Orders. Not with that chance to hit, though. Ah, uh, it's even worse. Problem is, he takes this leg, the ammo's in there. Oh, we got 0 to 120, though. Nothing in this arm. This torso's cased, so we're okay, I think. Standing by. Let's see if we can pressure this guy to leave. That's going to give them, what, one, two, three more guys to go for us, plus this guy. Let's just see what we can do here. Got it. I'm thinking I should have left. Targeting for physical attack. Oh! Oh my god, he got him! Okay, that changes things. That changes things. Alright. That's a kill. 50-50 now. Two left, two right. See what they do with their light guys here. Yeah, they're gonna hit me on the side. I didn't move, so I was expecting to leave, right? We had to kill the guy down here. Locus is gonna shoot me for for 60 now. Oh he missed.
So these two guys are part of the mainlands down here. He's going that way. That's a back shot. That's a freaking back shot. Commander. Acknowledged. That's a freaking back shot. Um Firing at What do you need? I'll do what I can. All weapons, fire. Okay, good shooting. Okay, almost got the torso. You don't need to be visible. Oh, that white's going to jump up, though. He's totally going to jump up. Where do you go? Right here, I guess. It's all indirect, but we gotta take the shot. Yes, come in. Take that shot, recoil. Come on, buddy. Finish the job, please. Finish the job. Good shooting, buddy. Good shooting. Okay, right torso and arm gone. Solid connection. Knocked down. Two pilot injuries. We'll go before him next turn. Okay. That white. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Panic! Panic! Ready for orders. Not you, recoil. We have a chance to kill this guy. That's the question. We don't really. Let's let him get up. We got to take this guy out. Good to go. So let's start it off. God, it's so low to hit there. It's even lower here, though. <sighs> okay, we're going to Vigilance, just in case this guy does not go down this turn, and fire everything into his backside. Okay, this guy's going to get up. Did he lose the Gauss Rifle? Yeah, it looks like he did. Yeah, he lost the Gauss Rifle. Okay. Alright, buddy. You know what I need. Get that boomstick up. Yeah, man. Finish it up. There's the knockdown. Yeah. 
Uh, let's go with recoil first. On the move. Full speed. Uh, what do we choose now? Headshot? We might get lucky. Oh, he's got the energy weapon in their head, though. If we go this route, we have, there's no guarantee we kill him, though. Let's go for the headshot. Just need a headshot, man. That's all we need. Yep. Moving to position. Okay, well, that guy's going on turn three next time, and we can't have that, so... Gotta use an offensive push on him. Push him back a turn. Gonna go for... No. Headshot again. Might get lucky. Acknowledge. Nope. At some point, our luck's gonna run out, so we have to be. Yeah, I like now. Damn it. Oh, God. If we lose this torso, we lose all our LRMs. We're almost out, too. Five more turns of the... So let's go with... Um, pylon first. No, recoil first. What can I do you for? Speed there in the Finish this guy up. There you go, moron. Tango down. Yes, Commander. All right, buddy. Start this off. Engaging. Come on, make him unstable. Make him unstable. Almost. Yep. <sighs> Just fire straight out. Gotta soften him up before we use uh, cold shot on this guy. No, 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 no. I know what you're up to. Oh, for Christ's sake. That could have been so much worse than what it was. We're going to have to bail on this.
god. Let's see if we can hit him in the core. What do you think, guys? It's all going to depend on how well, well Recoil does here. It's going down. Why can't he move? Stability warning, maybe? I don't know. Thirty left. Got to hit with five in the CT. No pain, no gain. Oh my god, that was so lucky. Then there was two. Guys, all yours, buddy. Putting my weight into it. That'll be it for him. He should be out cold now. A hit. No? Yep. And then there's just a dagger left. Okay, so now I can move. Actually, let's wait. Uh, recall first. Come on, buddy. Start this guy. Oh, he didn't move. Let's just try a headshot on this guy. Or should we try and core him? a lot of armor in that core. But yeah, we had to try. Yeah. That's not in the forest, but that is. I rather really take less damage. Just gonna fire straight out on this one. Get in the open. Last rounds to fire. 30% chance. Actually, you know what? Let's brace. We might get a better chance later on. Oh, you don't get to run away, dude. Someone's very angry and he's coming for you. Very, very, very angry. What do you need? She's almost out of ultra AC ammo. Need to get some heat back too anyway, so let's get down here and go after this guy. Can you not get around her? Eh, a little bit.
Where are you off to? Receiving you. Oh, he's taking hits in the arms already, so let's. Yeah, it's 45. 32. Let's just attack the side. Okay, he's tagged. Nice. Commander. Recoil first, because you got the speed. No problem. Everything on this guy's side. Let's just fire it. Alright, let's see what he does here. Um, it's not unstable. Oh, he's going to go down here, eh? Yeah, nice shooting. But we're coming for you. Well, for a second there, I thought we were going to have to pull out of this mission. On my way. Came pretty darn close to losing all our LRMs, though. Locked on for physical attack. Okay, let's see if we can finish this up here. What's up, Commander? Let's get right on this guy. Right in the kill zone, fire everything. Fire at all yeah. Come on, girl. Get right oh, we've only got one spot we can shoot him from. Copy that. Okay, you can do it. Wow. Oh, we ain't done yet. Ten ammo depleted. Uh Okay, forty three percent chance. Let's see what we get. There we go, knocked him down. Finally. Long range missiles depleted. I think this the ammo loadout I think is right. I mean, I think we could probably use a couple more turns of LRM ammo in the uh, Centurion. But I think, against the clans, I think if this was Inner Sphere Max, it wouldn't have been so bad. Sorry, buddy. You Take your wrath out on this guy. Alright, man. Kill him. Thank you. That could have been so much worse. There it is, folks. One Skull Clan mission. We did actually pretty well on that. I was kind of shocked. 121,000, which is not even going to come anywhere close to covering our repairs. But at least we didn't lose any weapon systems. Um, one bit of uh, damage to LRM-20, but not much. We just lost one ton of ammo, which had already been depleted at that point. So, And the rest of these mechs did really well. So the Centurion is a huge target right now. A huge target. So I'm thinking we may have to switch out the dead fire ammo and go with the LRM ammo uh, or the Artemis ammo and go back to the long range firing. But we'll see what we'll see what happens against in the next mission up against uh, Inner Sphere guys. Okay, tons of clan parts here. I don't even know where to begin. ATM 12. Uh that's going in there for sure right now. Large pulse, large heavy laser, 90 damage, 68 heat. Medium pulsed clans. 
small heavy lasers 30 damage 15 heat very low range though we already got ultra 10 clan directional jets wow clan cockpits look at them all endo steel clan xl engine clan which i think is a no-brainer um fusion cores for fibrous cooling pods which are our clan cooling pods look how much minus five percent weapon heat generated uh wow just wish we got more salvage out of this tts plus two energy uh, increased chance for critical hit 10 percent increased range with energy weapons these are nice but not ne necessary well we could give them to pilot or to our uh, recoil in the uh, Phoenix Hawk. Clan cockpits give us what? Breaching shot. Increased sensor and sight range. Uh, Clan endo steel is less, is less slots reserved. And feral, feral lamellar. Minus 20% damage taken. Plus 20% structure points. Minus 12% armor t protection per point of armor. Huh. Minus 20% damage taken. I don't know. That's like two million too. Like we could just sell it. I know everyone's going, no, don't sell it. I'm gonna take the cooling pod instead though. I think overall that's the direction I wanna go. For now. I mean we're gonna be getting more client stuff in the future. But I think this is going to help me immediately. Which is really what I want, is the immediate help. So let's see what else we get here. One, two, three, three fire starter, two Cs. We got four parts of them now. Kentaro, two C parts, two of them, and a white part. Ah. Clan flamer, small heavy laser. Ah. Endo steel and ferro fibers, nice. Okay, cool. All right, two hundred thirty-four thousand in repairs. We knew it was going to be a lot. Then we have to refit the uh, the Centurion too. So let's uh, manage our tasks here. Centurion's out for twenty-three days. Let's get that at number one. Phoenix Hawk, Hunchback, Wolverine. Let's go in this row. Uh, yeah, let's go that order. So we're going to end the episode here. It was a very long episode, but it was definitely well worth it. I'm going to get this stuff fixed in the meantime, go past the financial report, um, and get into the next month. Cold Metal is going to be out of actions, but we have lots of other pilots that we can bring in in the meantime for the next uh, mission. So if you liked the episode, please drop a like below. If you have any comments on the episode, maybe what I could have done a little different. I don't think there was really too much I could have done differently. Uh, other than rather than going straight down after the fire starters to go up the hill immediately. Um, that's really the only the only other thing I saw as being an issue. I wasn't expecting the uh, clan reinforcements to get in that close that fast. So anyway, but uh, yeah, if you have any comments, drop them in the, in the uh, um, comment section below. Feel free to subscribe and until next time, I'll see you all later.